Fetching data. Error. Analysis failed. Paddy. Long. Wishes. Danger. Xiang Li. Help. Help. I gotcha. Something seems to have malfunctioned with you. I'll take care of it. One moment. Run onboard diagnostics. Command initiator, Xian Li Yao. Authentication confirmed. Performing onboard diagnostics number 231. Onboard diagnostics failed. Faltering switches. Beep beep. Wishing for a brighter future. Glory on the battlefield. Abandon hope of loved ones returning home. Beep beep. It's possible that Patty's memory is overloaded with wishes, leading to anomalies mixed within. Wishes. Analyzing cause. 21 solutions have been provided. Correction. 12. Correction. 4. Wishes. And solutions. Could this relate to what Chisha said about someone at Moon Tree Lodge making wishes come true? And Xiang Li Yao. The name sounds familiar. Perhaps. Isolating abnormal data. Running data correction. There. Give it another go, Patty. Performing onboard diagnostics. All systems normal. Patty feels full. That should do the trick for now. But where could the anomalies have... I apologize for keeping you waiting. It's just a temporary measure. I'll need to conduct a thorough examination later. Thank you for returning him to me. Yes, I've heard a lot about you from my colleagues at the Academy. Many of them are eager to meet you. I hope their enthusiasm hasn't been too overwhelming for you. Xiang Li Yao, a pleasure to meet you. I regret that I was away during your first visit to the Academy, but I'm glad to finally have the chance to meet you. I merely provided a few ideas, but I'm glad I was able to help. I was assisting the Ministry of Development with the damaged surveillance tower. By the time I returned to the lab, you'd already left. The next time I heard any news about you was regarding the battle at the Norfall Barrens. This- Well, come to think of it, I should be thanking you personally. The Moon Tree Lodge wouldn't have opened as planned if it weren't for you. I'm afraid I'm not the owner of the Moon Tree Lodge. I'm just here to assist collecting and trying to fulfill everyone's wishes. However, I do hope you can keep that between us. We imagine how disheartening it would be for people to learn their wishes were granted by a single person. I just want to do something within my power to pass on the joy we've all felt at least once in our lives. Seeing everyone's wishes come true, and everyone enjoying the festival, is enough for me. Fulfilling wishes. Happy! What will you taste like? Important gift! Apologies. Patty doesn't mean anything strange by that. Patty was born in the Moon Tree Lodge. It deciphers the emotions behind wishes, analyzing their structure in a unique way. To Patty, every wish has a unique taste. You can think of it as Patty's way of understanding the world. Besides bringing Patty back, I presume you're here to make a wish as well? In that case, may I suggest we head over to the wishing stall for a chat? It's not far from here. 
Welcome. I, I wish I could extend a warmer greeting, but Patty has run into some technical difficulties. We cannot accept new wishes at Moon Tree Lodge until I resolve the issue. I apologize for the inconvenience. I would be glad to take note of your wish and have it prioritized once everything is resolved. I see. Why don't you take a tour around the Vale? Jinjo is filled with festivities during this time, and losing yourself in the crowds could very well bring your wish into sharper focus. Speaking from my own experience, of course. Feel free to do as you like. For now, I must concentrate on restoring the Moon Tree Lodge as quickly as possible. In a nutshell, it appears Patty's malfunction is more than a straightforward data error. At first, I suspected an overload of Patty's analysis module due to an accumulation of wishes over the years. However, during my recent testing, I discovered unusual codes embedded within Patty's database. Like a virus, they spread drastically with the addition of each wish. Additionally, although it was only for a brief moment, I detected abnormal frequency fluctuations after connecting Patty to my terminal. In theory, a robot's data should not generate such fluctuations. It's too early to draw a conclusion just yet, but I can't leave the matter unresolved. It'll only be a matter of time before all the wishes stored in the Moon Tree Lodge are devoured by this abnormal code. I've isolated the four wishes with unreadable codes, pinpointing the... I plan to track down whoever made these wishes, try to fulfill them, and uncover the root cause of these anomalies. But before that, I need to try to decode the wishes corrupted by these anomalies. To minimize data loss, it would be best to complete this a week before the Moon Chasing Festival. With careful planning... It does have its challenges, but everyone's hopes and dreams for the festival are in these wishes. I don't intend to let them down. Yes. Ying Ying and the rest have set their hearts on this festival. I appreciate the gesture, but I wouldn't want to trouble you. <laughs> I see. Thank you. Well then, the Moon Tree Lodge welcomes its newest member. Seems we have a new friend now, Patty. You, Jenly, Yao, and Patty, wishes come true. Organize Moonlit Fair. Yes, the lodge opens to the public before the Moonlit Fair, but it still remains an important element of the festivities. The market vendors like to tailor their offerings according to everyone's wishes. There will be many interesting activities on the day of the fair, and preparations are well underway. Perhaps some of your friends will be among those attending. If you're interested, you can go and take a look yourself. The Academy. Initiating analysis. This individual wishes to disappear from this world, indicating a desire to terminate their existence and for all associated social connections to be abrased. Feasibility, 0%. Causing physical harm or manipulating human memories are actions strictly prohibited. Uh, this is Shang Li, Patty's work buddy. Patty gathers and analyzes the wishes, and Shang Li helps make them become a reality. <sighs> Shang Li is the first prototype of its series, and we used to call it by its serial number. 
My colleagues at the academy began calling it Little Shangli out of convenience. And over time, it became the name we use now. <laughs> well, it seems to like this name a lot. So consider it a birthday gift from everyone at the academy. Analysis conclusion. The wish exhibits strong self-denial and self-destructive tendencies, indicating a high level of danger. Prompt physical care and psychological intervention are advised. Patty does not understand this wish. Patty does not, cannot hurt humans. Just as I've suspected. This is the reason why this wish failed to be interpreted. The desire to disappear directly conflicts with Patty's underlying logic of not being able to harm humans. Written words are different from data. Data represent precise and unified content, while words may harbor meanings deeper than they seem on the surface. It is often the case that words spoken aloud sometimes contradict our innermost thoughts. Those willing to entrust their wishes to the Moon Tree Lodge hope their desires will be chosen and fulfilled. This suggests that Xiao Sheng still hopes for his voice to be heard. This is just my personal belief, but I suspect he's not truly ready to give up. I think the thought pains him. Which means he's... Yes, I believe that is the case. I want to uncover the true desire hidden in his wish and help him fulfill it. Will fulfilling his true wish help to ease his suffering? Yes, I hope it will. We should start by locating the Wisher. If I recall correctly, there is no Xiao Sheng at the Academy, so it's likely a pseudonym. Fortunately, we know that he's a researcher, so it shouldn't be too difficult for us to find him. And this paper, it's from a type of notebook commonly used at the Academy. There are faint traces of another type of writing on it. Seems to be some kind of code. I'll decipher these codes, and then we can... Uh, oh, excuse me. Investigator shang -Li, we have a problem. We've got trouble in the lab. Prototype 49's core has gone out of control. Emergency protocols failed, and it's overheating as we speak. Lock down the lab. I'm on my way. What about the experiment locks? Already sent to your terminal, sir. All right. Tell everyone to stay calm. We still have time. There's been a momentary setback in the research. I need to handle it right away. I'm afraid I'll have to leave the task of finding Xiao Sheng to you. Thank you. I'll meet up with you as soon as I have the issue resolved. Here, take Xiang Li with you to help with the investigation. I already have a few speculations as to the contents of the code. I'll call you once it's confirmed. Good luck, my friend.